Hey guys, what's going on? I hope you guys are having a great day because I know I am and don't be looking in the camera over there, the mirror over there because it just looks like a whole bunch of other errands and that's just weird. You gotta focus on me, okay? Just focus on me. Well, let's get this lighting fixed better. But anyways, I hope you guys are having a great day because I know I am. Let's get today started. I have amazing news to tell you guys because of the fact that last weekend was probably one of the best weekends I've ever had in my entire life. I know you guys may think I'm probably lying, but no, I'm serious. It really was the best day of my life, uh, well actually the weekend, because of the fact that my dad, not only him, but my girlfriend, Persithia, as you guys already all know, she was able to come along with me and we were able to hang out for the entire weekend. Unfortunately, I did not record really anything while I was there. So it kind of sucks because I'm kind of sad about it because I was like, I kind of wish I could do it, but I don't have any content for you guys for the weekend that just passed by, but we do have a video that Persithia was so amazingly allowed me to have her record. She basically is going to explain everything that she felt when she came here and like she was, she was scared because she's never been on a plane before or anything like that so bear with her. She's also never vlogged before other than with me but I'm always the one on the camera holding it so she's never been vlogging or whatever so she's been really nervous but she made a great video so I tried to edit as best as I could but with uh, her edits you know or not her edits but the way she recorded she kind of cut it out real quick so I'm going to do the best I can to make it better for you guys so you guys will be at least standable so you can watch it but basically she's going to explain everything that happened this weekend more than I can because you know from a girl it's a little bit different she can explain a little bit more so hopefully it will make sense to you but this weekend is just the best because we went down to Dallas we were able to go out and have some fun eat some great food and I got to hang out with my dad because I I've basically been having like a hard time here because of the fact that it really hit me that like I'm gone like you know like I'm in the military now and I can't really just go and leave and go see my friends and family whenever I want to and it's something that sucks but we have to get used to it we're gonna have to start adapting to it but I've gotten better now um, I needed distractions for class because it was just I couldn't focus that's how sad I was but I actually made a goal and motivated myself so I decided to do really good on my classes and the last test I just took, actually the last two I've aced and except for the last one I got 100%. The other one before that I missed one freaking question which really got me but hey could have got two different A's or whatever or I did get two A's anyways but I, I did really good. I set a goal so at the end of the month or whatever I was going to be able to see 4C and my dad and look it, it happened so yeah. I know I'm speaking like super super fast but if I don't speak fast I know this video is going to be super long but Bear with 4C, she's going to go ahead and uh, talk for you guys a little bit, and I'll let those clips roll. and kind of nervous like I'm scared but not really like I'm just nervous to like go on the plane and stuff since like I haven't but I'm not like scared well I'm excited because I haven't seen him in like months like I think the last time I saw him was like New Year's Eve but I'm not sure it might have been like the day after so our flights like at 3 50 and I don't know exactly what time we're gonna get there tonight but it's like a two hour drive after that so it might be like 8 or 10 I'm not sure so we'll see if I get to see him today if not tomorrow for sure but hopefully today I promised Aaron that I'd make like a video of coming back from the trip like how I feel and stuff so I'm supposed to make this video like right when I got back from the flight or when I got off but I kind of was like putting it off because I didn't want to because I'm like I'm not used to like taking videos of myself like I'm really shy so like it's hard for me to like talk in front of like my the camera and stuff like before like it was a lot worse when I first started da dating Aaron because he was like first doing like the whole YouTube thing so it was hard for me because like I'm just really shy like I'm not good at this kind of stuff but I just thought I'd try but besides that like we had a lot of fun um it went by really fast which sucks like it was really hard 
on Monday, like, saying bye and, like, knowing that I can't see him for a long time again because it's been hard, like, not seeing each other for, like, a lot of months since, like, New Year's or sometime around there. We had so much fun, and um, hopefully the next couple months goes by fast. Like, it sucks, like, being so far away from each other, but it's all going to be worth it, like, later on when it's all over. I mean, obviously, like, long distance isn't fun. Like, it's not easy in, like, any relationship. Especially when you're used to, like, seeing that person, like, all the time. Which is, like, how we were. But we've made it work. Like, we always, like, work through everything. We've been together for, like, two years. And, um, yeah, it was more difficult, like, when he was in boot camp. Because we couldn't really talk at all. Like, only write letters. Because he didn't have his phone. But now... He has his phone, so we can talk every day, at least on that, and FaceTime and stuff, which is cool, and yeah, but I'm wearing this necklace he gave me, which is really cute, um, I don't know if you could see it, but it has like a heart, and it says, my heart belongs to an airman, which is cute, and also my bracelet. Here's a bracelet he got me, it says his name, and it has a heart, it's like braided which is cute um he always gets mad at me because I always forget to put it on sometimes too but not lately um but yeah so I don't know where he got it but he gave it to me like a year ago so basically like when I got there uh it was like we had it once we landed in Dallas like we had to drive like uh me and his dad had to drive to um where he was stationed which is like Shepherd Air Force Base, something like that, and that was like another like two hour drive. But once we got there, like it was really late, like later than we expected it to be, and um, so it was really late, like it was one o'clock. And Aaron had told me that he didn't do well enough, well, well enough on the test to be able to stay overnight, so I wouldn't be able to, I'd just be able to do like a quick high and then. Uh, wait till the morning to see him so I was kind of bummed out because like I was like like I finally got here to see you and had to just go to bed but um he got in the car and I was like super scared well not scared I was just like nervous because I hadn't seen him in like a while so I didn't know like how it feel I guess I don't know but um so he got in the car and then um after, like, he got, like, situated and, like, checked in and stuff, um, he came back, and I, like, sat, I, like, moved to sit next to him, and, um, he, it was already past one, so I was kind of confused to why, like, he wasn't, like, still rushing to get back on time, um, because it, it was, like, he was talking to his dad about, like, how he had to be back, like, soon, and his dad was, like, going along with it, because I think he knew, so I was, like, I really thought, like, he couldn't, and so, but then he was, like, no, I'm just kidding, and, like, I, I can stay overnight, so we ended up, like, staying up to, like, really late, because it was already one o'clock in the morning, but, yeah, so, I mean, we don't, we didn't really, like, take videos or vlog while we were out there, which we probably should have, but it was really nice of his dad to, like, take the time out to, go out there like to see him and like take me because I would have been scared to like do all that by myself since I wouldn't know what I was doing because I've never been on a plane before so it was cool um I got to spend time with him and then like learn some things like so now like I know like pretty like have a I- good idea of like what to do to, like how to the process works and stuff and we had a lot of fun like I'm Like, it was, like, really important for us to, like, see each other. Like, we were dying, kind of. Like, we really missed each other. And, um, I don't know. It was just really fun. And we had a good time. It's hard, like, on regular days. Because on Tuesdays and Thursdays, like, I go to school all day. And every other day, like, I work. And Erin, um, has, has class at 2 o'clock which is 12 o'clock here so by 12 o'clock here like I have to like call him like make sure I talk to him before he leaves because he's he won't be back till midnight which is 10 o'clock over here so not too late 
but like I have to like spend the whole day basically with like no one to talk to it sucks it's kind of just not fun not having anyone to talk to because we're so used to talking to each other like every day so now it's like I only get to talk to him a little bit in the morning and then at night before we go to sleep but we always call each other I'm really happy though that I got to go because it was like really hard to like be able to go like make it all work um just like because of work and stuff it was hard to like get those days off that I needed but like it all worked out and um I actually got to see him more than I thought I was going to because originally like he was gonna have to like be back at a certain time every day and I wasn't gonna get there till Friday like late and his like curfew is like one usually so I wasn't gonna get there till like one so I would I'd have to wait till uh Saturday morning to see him so that would only leave like two more days two days but not fully because like he had to be back like on Sunday also earlier um but it all worked out like he actually ended up being allowed to stay overnight since he did like such a good job on his tests which I'm super proud of him about because it's like really hard stuff that he had to do.